A middle-class family is recovering after being forced to travel on a megabus. <laughs> has more on the story for us, Emma. Bill Mackay, a well-spoken man with his own office, travelled to London from Reading with his wife Lucy and three polite children to see some tasteful art at the Tate Modern. But what should have been a status-affirming day out turned into a smelly, low-budget nightmare when train cancellations left the Waitrose frequenting family with no option but to take a megabus. I took the last remaining seat next to the lavatories beside it gentleman who was very loudly playing music from his, his phone. <laughs> the air was full of the sounds and smells of people devouring all sorts of different provisions. <laughs> a child was screaming, a woman two rows in front of me, weeping audibly. <laughs> yeah. It's a little concerned that my proximity to the WC would be a problem, but it was such a relatively short journey that I thought Nobody could have cause to defecate. <laughs> How wrong I was. <laughs> At the end of their agonising two-hour journey, the Mackay family were airlifted to a sushi restaurant and given an emergency <laughs> visit. They were expected to make a full recovery, although doctors believe Lucinda Mackay may write a book.